Hey everyone, I'm Nog, and welcome back to Anno 1800, a brand new series we're starting on today. Uh, so, we're going to go with a sandbox game, and we're going to go with uh, less gu guidance. We don't need that much guidance, I think. So, let's choose a portrait. I guess we'll go with, uh, with this guy, I think. Hmm... Anyone else we would rather be? Nah, that guy's fine. Let's do him. And what do we want for our logo? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I think I'll go with the ship here. And I don't want to be that color, because as I've mentioned before, I am colorblind, and that color and that color is more or less the same to me. So I'll be that color. Yellow, I guess. And no, we're not going to be DW Brewster, we're going to be uh, Happy Nerdsome. Okay. And the Imperial train and the Imperial command ship is fine. Now, I want to go with advanced, uh, but I want to customize it a bit. But we didn't actually select advanced, which is a little bit annoying. So. We'll do a seed called uh, 1234 and see what that gives us. And you can put in that seed if you want. We're going to put in difficulty preset advanced. And let's see, starting world size medium. I think we want it large. Yeah, large. Island size mainly medium mainly small mainly large let's go with mainly medium island difficulty we'll leave that at normal fertility we'll leave at medium medium map type uh, let's see what do we have snowflake corners island arc at all, archipelago, or random. Let's do with. Let's go with at all. Okay. Then we'll move on to characters. And Bender is not going to be in the game, but Dr. Hugo Mercer is the new anarchist. I challenge you to oversee your own transformation. Don't wait for your people to make it for you. Okay. So, Dr. Hugo Mercier, a self-proclaimed anarchist, Dr. Mercier has created a radical new society free of the influence of the state. Formerly a champion of a student union of dentists, Mercier was asked by the Queen to use his popular appeal to pacify increasing threats of revolution in her territories. Instead, Mercier sided with the protesters, declaring the people's complete independence from crown authority. So, he's going to be in there. And let's see, who else do we want? So we've had, in the last playthrough, we had Beryl, Artua, and Alonzo. So I guess we'll go with, uh, actually, we could just go with George and Carl Leonard von Mulching. Yeah, why not? And faction customization, we're not going to do anything here. Features, income, medium, that's fine. Inactive upkeep on. Yeah, why not? Uh, instruction cost refunds half. Building relocation, a coins. I think we'll just put that on. Trading post restocks normal. City incidents medium. Quest frequency common, that's fine. Starting conditions, flagship, 
starting harbor standard and starting capital medium and bring me back is off that's fine and victory conditions we'll just I think we'll just leave it off and set our own uh, we could do maybe a target population of 25,000 yeah, because I don't know if the game ends if we choose a victory condition. Let's just leave them off and uh, end the game when we feel like we've won or lost. So, alright. Let's start the game. Okay, we're in. Let's uh, pause real quick and have a quick look at our island. So, looks pretty good. And we have our ship on pause. Attention for the Admiral. So we have timber, steel, and weapons. And here we have a bit of stuff. Let's send our flagship out exploring immediately. And look down there in the corner. See what's down there. I want this to be this way, so we're looking north. It makes things a lot easier. Okay, let's have a look up at our island. We have potatoes, grain, red peppers. We have some clay, iron, one coal, copper, limestone, and a bit of oil. So very nice. And we've discovered a new island here does it have hops red pepper and fur buns okay that might actually not be a bad island to settle as our second island and it's nice and close also has one clay coal and sink you know what we are going to do that aye, aye. right away we're going to settle this island nice and close to our Starting island, and hopefully there won't be that much uh, pirate interference and stuff like that with our trade between the two islands. So yeah, we are going to settle this island straight away. Come on, we're going to put the harbor there. Build the trading post. Flagship ready for orders. Alright. So we uh, have Scars back as our primary, and we have, then we have Bristle over here as our secondary island. Very nice. So let's get building while the ship sails out and explores a bit. We're going to build out here. And let's see. Have a bit of a cliff there, which is a little bit annoying. We have the clay over there. Yeah. Okay. So I think we're going to have our city up here at the harbor. And I want to do a road over here. And I think. We'll do an avenue here. Kind of. Alright. And then we'll have an avenue coming out this way as well. Kind of a central I present street. my humble duty to you. Alright, we met and Star I'm confident Archibald. you'll transcend nice. your present circumstance. Okay. So that's done. Then we need to build our marketplace. And we're going to have that here on the corner of the avenue. And I think I'm going to rotate it like so. And then we need some farmer residences. So we're going to build a little bit differently this time. 
think. Hmm. Hey, let's see, we need six bases or what? No, nine. Okay, so this is three, six, nine. Road from there. And we'll put five houses. You reached a new milestone. Like that. And we'll build some road up along the side here. Alright. Good, good. So far, so good. Okay. We need to get some timber going. So let's build a lumberjack's hut. We can, for now, we can just build them out here. That'll be fine. Game safe. And then we can put one over here, I guess. Actually, let's put them close together so we'll move the other one. You I'll do. I want to move. And stick you up here, I think. Yeah. And one more. Right there. Put some roads going out to these two. There, and then we need some sawmills. We need four of those. So what we'll do is stick one there, one there. Rotate you, stick you there, stick you there, and then we need a small warehouse. It's going to stick down here. Or what? Actually, we'll, I think we'll stick it in here, where it doesn't interfere with any of them. And put the road inside, and one going down. All right. Well, there we go. We have timber being made. That's good. Then... What I want to do is put in some more farmer residences. We'll do like this. And we'll leave a space in between in the middle here. Oops. Move you. Down there. And then do some road around. Right. So there'll be a nice green area in between there. So hopefully by leaving a green area in at least some of the rows of houses here, we will reduce the risk of, of fires and also will maybe make the island a little bit prettier. But while we wait for some timber to come in, let's go have a look at the other islands that we found. So we have hops, nider, and potatoes. Mm -hmm. Actually, not a bad island. Not a bad island at all. And then we have here, where we have hops, red peppers, and grapes. Small island. And we have here, and we have hops and nider. Okay, also a small island. And we have such a little black there. So, yeah. Alright. So let's uh, keep exploring. Service. Go down here in the other corner. Take a look. What's that? An empire covers oh, both so land cool. and sea. Okay. Alright. So we have a few more. So let's put these out of blueprint mode. There we go. And we can build the road over there. Oops. There. 
Okay. Good. So new buildings have been unlocked. Well, we need to get the fishery going. Can afford that actually. So let's get fishery going. Let's get two fisheries going actually. One there. This road. And try it again. Okay, so it goes all the way down there. Alright. Game save. And there we go. Alright, so we have a couple of fisheries. And I don't think we really need anything else right now here. Hmm. We have any materials over here we do. But what we could do is actually get this island going a little bit too. Might not be a bad idea. But this is our main, so... But what do we want to do here? We do need to build some more houses. Well, let's build some Worry not. Resources. You've nothing to oh. fear from Hugo Mercier. We've met I Dr. Am a Mercier. But the people, the people, there is a rampant beast. Why? Think of them not as possessions, but as tools. He's talkative. Chatty. Right, so Dr. Mercier is down here. He is way ahead of us. As in, way, way ahead of us. Hogan Knaus. Okay. Alright. So, do we have. We not, don't have enough people yet. So, let's build some more farmer residences. There. A new milestone. There, there, and build the road around. All right, we're up to a village now, which means that we can make schnapps and work clothes. Very good. So, where do we want to have farming? I think we'll have farming down here. Yeah, seems like a good place to have it, so let's build a road. Oh. Uh, I don't have enough wood for the bridge. Need 20 lumber for the bridge. We'll just build the road down there for now. And then save up a bit of wood for the bridge. Alright, another island. Grain. Fur and grape. Okay. Right. So let's actually start building over here. We can. So let's do it. And this is obviously going to be our beer production island. a marketplace and put it here maybe yeah and I think we're going to do the same here so leave a bit of space for some open area some parks and stuff Some farmer residences. That's five. Alright. And we do need to get timber production going over here as well. So let's pull the road out. And build a couple of lumberjack huts. 
and a couple of sawmills. There. All right. So we're getting a bit of timber in there as well. Very good. We have a lot of timber here. So that's nice. Let's get the road across and down here. And we do have another uh, shore here where we can build on. All right. So let's see. We need clay for any of this? I don't think so. No. Well, let's build some potato farms. Build them on this side. When people are starving, why turn your nose up at the potato? Exactly. But we're not going to be eating the potatoes. We're going to make, be making schnapps out of them. Of the Mercer. This, uh, it's very important to have a bit of schnapps. And we do need some distilleries. Actually, I think I want to move this. Move this up here for now. And let's just build a couple of distilleries here on the other side of the road. Hmm. They call it civilization. There. Alright. So, we have schnapps production. Let's relocate you again and put you down here. So, right. Good. And that warehouse can also support the clay deposit once we can start doing that. So, that's schnapps being produced. So, now they can get a little bit drunk, but they can't. But we'll have to do it naked because we don't have clothes yet. Mm, but uh, hey. that's life. All right, what do we have on this island? The peppers, hops, and over here, furs, grapes. Okay, let's Flagship keep exploring. All right. So, how are we looking on people here? We need more. We just have to plow through. We need more. So, let's build some farmer residences. There we go. And build the road over here. Okay. So, I think I want to build the road out this way as well. And then I want to have some sheep farms. Let's build one first and get these in. Okay, so that's pretty. I couldn't remember if it was these or the pig farms. What you say your name was? Annoying, but hmm. it was the pig farms. That's a strong name. Don't let it down. Happy Nerdson is a very strong name, Mr. Smith. Okay, framework knitters. Let's get those in. We'll put them in here. Dress as one, but think apart. All right. So we need. So this takes thirty seconds. That takes thirty seconds. So that's fine. And actually, for the schnapps, thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. So that's fine. All right. Good. So let's put in a fire station before a fire breaks out this time. Put it in there. 
And let's put in a pub so people don't get cranky about not having a place to get wasted. Put the pub over here on the main road, I think. Hmm. Yeah. There, we can always move it. Okay. So we met Mr. Smith. He's down here. He has a quest for us. Might be a good idea to do. But right now we're exploring. I think exploring is say? quite important to do. And what does this island offer? It's a big one, pretty big one. Quite nice. Quite nice. Worked for shortage. Big island. Yeah, quite big island. And our ship is sailing away. Alright, so we had a workforce short shortage over here, so we need to build some more armor residences. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Now there shouldn't be a workforce shortage. We have two extra armors. Over here we do have a workforce shortage though. Quite a big one. So let's build some more residences. There. Okay, and we'll do over here as well while we're at it. Put in the roads. There we go. We're actually out of timber, so the last three we need to upgrade from blueprints at some point. Okay. It's fine. So let's have a look at our situation here. We do have fish, and it's going up. We do have schnapps, it's steady, and we have no work clothes, but. It will be coming in and it's stable, but I think we'll get more. I do believe so. Alright, let's upgrade you guys. Alright, we are okay on workers now. Is this the island that we just looked at? Yeah. There's a tiny little island here. And over here. And we are base we basically come all the way up here. And it's time to move across and get back to our home island. And then we'll explore the middle after that. Okay. So we're doing quite well. We have all of the services. How are Gives you? like part of the family. We need a more, some more work clothes. Let's just build one more uh, mm. of these production chains so that we get some work clothes going. There. All right. So basically all they need is a bit of work clothes and we'll be able to get workers, which is really good. And how are we doing? Fish is going up, schnapps is... It says it's stable, but it's going up slightly, and that's fine. And we do have work clothes, all right. So let's move over here and have a look. We are... Oh, I forgot to put in a small warehouse for these guys. Let's do that. Put it in there. And we don't actually have enough timber to do that. Darn it. Okay. 
So I'm going to have to send some timber over from the other island, but that's flagship fine. The ship, flagship is going up this way anyway. So, all right. The Fortitude, nice name for a ship. Okay, we're getting work clothes. Yay! Does that mean that we can upgrade? Yes, it does. Your workers understand the need to work hard. Don't patronize them. I'm not being patronizing. You're being patronizing. You reached a new milestone. Age of industrialization. Very nice. So we have workers now. Very good. So this is Bonus going to be it for the first episode of the brand new series of Anno 1800. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and maybe subscribe, and I'll see you next time.